I'm recording this because I may or may not do a video uh, talking about my grasshopper climbing wall and getting it installed. I've just backed my truck into my shop here and opened up the crate, having uh, worked to get it off the back of the uh, delivery truck up the road. Uh, you can see I got my campus board here above the door and I got my hang boards and pull-up bar and all that. Um, and now I'm gonna put the climbing wall in this uh, other end of the shop. I've cleared out some room in my loft and uh, put the loft back a bit and uh, should be pretty good. So I've just... All right, I now have everything unloaded. Um, you can see all the metalware there on my uh, drop cloth, a lot of uh, the two big skids and then a whole bunch of metal stuff. So we'll see how that all goes together. Nothing too heavy, I could get it all down by myself, but uh, in aggregate, it's pretty heavy. And I got a big pile of holds, um, got some wiring. I did get the LED kit, two boxes of other stuff here. Looks like some screws and lenses and that one. And then in here we got um, bolts and other mounting hardware. And then it comes with all this uh, instructional stuff. I guess some sort of uh, overall booklet and then uh, instructions for installation. So that's what I'll be doing tomorrow because I am having to take care of my kids right now. All right, I got my helper, Wyatt. He's helping out with this bolts. How's it going, Wyatt? Good. We're doing the skis right now. We got my other helper, Cora. She's doing the Lego portion of the wall, right, Cora? We're making progress. My helpers are here, but they're getting ready for lunch, as am I. Um, we've done some good work, though. We have the skids all set up, and we have the bottom three cross beams all set up. Um, it's been pretty uh, successful so far. Oop. <laughs> Hello. Um, you can see they just kind of all bolt together, and um, you need a ratchet set and some wrenches, but um, so far so good. I've now gotten as far as I can today. I've made good progress. I've, um, I now have the frame and the skids, the lower frame assembled. I've uh, attached the, uh, the gas springs here. Um, it's a little, uh, a little, little tricky, but not so bad once you figure out how to do it. And I'm ready to attach uh, this guide here with the, uh, the, that tells you your angle, but unfortunately, it's just, it's, the, the springs are a little too stiff. I'm not quite strong enough to pull this down or heavy enough to pull this down to engage it. They mentioned that might be the case in the directions. I'm trying to get this bolt and handle uh, through there. And so I'm gonna have to go to the hardware store and get some tension straps. Um, again, they said you might need to do that, so stay tuned. I was able to uh, get this done with the two tension straps, which you can see here. Basically what I had to do was ratchet this towards me here, which enabled me to complete the installation of that currently at about 10 degrees. We're now working on the upper frame. We're laying it out and Wyatt is working on the ratcheting of the bolts. All right, we keep making progress here. We were able to attach the upper section to the lower section by using the saw horses and some grunt and Wyatt. And now we're uh, just finishing attaching the metal frame and then we'll be able to go to the, uh, to the wood after that, doing some projects, art projects as well. All right, we're doing the wood panels. We got the first panel on and we're putting in the, uh, the bolts. We have two of the three wood panels now installed. It's been a little tricky to line up the screws with the holes, but we're doing okay. It's kind of iterative. Got my helpers, and here we go. I 
I'm here with my helper, Rosalie, and with Rosalie's help, we have completed the wall portion of the wall. You can see it in all its glory. It's about 15 degree overhanging right now. Um, and finally, with all the weight of the wood on it, the tension springs are appropriately weighted. Although I have a little bit of trouble initiating it when it's only like a little less than 10 degree overhanging. Um, I have trouble pulling off the top. So I think with the holds, it'll be fine. I'll be able to pull off the holds, but I set up this pulley system here uh, to help uh, help it all work. But overall, very happy with it. And now on to the holds uh, and then the lights. We've now started to put the holds on with the blue ones and why it's started to monkey around a bit. So far, so good. Slowly making progress. Wyatt's practicing his traversing. <laughs> Still working on the flow holds. We're here working on the board, making progress with the holds. Got my helper, Cora, and the videographer, Wyatt's gonna help us capture how you actually do the holds. You uh, take the Allen, big Allen wrench, put it through here to anchor it. And it comes with these screws of different sizes. And it gives you an angle and orientation to do the hold at. You drill it in. I need to go on your back. Yeah. You do the other one. Eh? And you pull it out. And that's where the light goes. <laughs> All right, you can turn it off, sweetie. Even though I'm not done with the wall yet, I've started to do a little bit of training. Currently it's set at 40 degrees. With Cora's help, we have now finished all the holds onto the electrical. Wall still doesn't have lights, but pads have just arrived. You sure can, sweetie? Came in two big things. This is one of them. And we're getting them unpacked. I'm embarking on the long journey of light installation. You can see I got some lenses in and I got some wire action starting in the back. So making progress, maybe about a little less than a third of the way done. You can see you kind of just snake the wires up and down on the back and uh, a little tedious, but uh, once you get the hang of it, it moves pretty quickly. I'm now done with my board. Got my pad all set up here. Right now I just have the board totally up at an angle. If I turn it on, got the box set up here and the lights in the back. Lights in the front and just running through the warm up. Ready to do some climbing. <laughs> 